guess you had a feeling that how much you master the order flow, how much you master the market structure, the less it works for you. Sometimes the price just goes and violates your level. Whenever you're gonna place your buy order over here, the price goes down and then maybe continues in your direction or just completely reverses. So this is gonna be covered in today's lesson what you are doing wrong and what is the difference between liquidity grab and market structure continuation okay hey what's up guys welcome to our powered investing youtube channel this is sultan of fx with you as i have mentioned in the previous uh like slight previous uh points of the video today we're gonna cover what is the difference between the market structure break the continuation of the order flow and the liquidity grab the most like in the previous ancient times the people who never learned the smart money concepts and they just traded with the regular like methods they called it uh kind of like false breakout so let's begin guys so uh, we do have a structure. We know the structure is when the price is making a higher highs, higher highs and higher lows. Whenever its next high is higher than the previous and the, its next low is higher than the previous low, we are in the uptrend. Uh, we're, we should define this one. It's very important, guys. So when we are on the downtrend, we are making a consistent lower lows and consistent lower highs. So this is called a downtrend, guys. And mostly, as a smart money traders and whatever trade you're gonna, uh, whatever trader you're gonna call yourself, uh, you have to continue according to the trend. As it's always called, the trend is your friend, guys. So um, most of the times, as smart money traders, we look for an order blocks, the breaker blocks, imbalances for aiming to our trades. And we say that consistent highs and consistent higher lows or uh, this structure is called our trend. But sometimes the price just goes below the previous low grabs the liquidity and completely reverses and you don't know like when the price just make this break of structure you might go and trade the retracement find some auto block over here and then just uh, wait for a price to push further to the downside but sometimes it does not happen the price just goes and continues its up move because um, this break of structure to the downside was just a liquidity grab for us to make sure that the that there is a break of structure and there is a change of the trend a change of the market structure we have to wait for a confirmation that the trend has completely reversed so uh, the secret is the first break to the downside is not enough when we do have this uh, first break of structure to the downside it might be liquidity grab this uh, liquidity grab impulse to the downside might go below this previous low it can go below the two lows it can go below even three four five ten whatever lows and then just completely reverse to the upside so it doesn't matter how far the price just retraces makes it its pullback so it does not indicate that the price is changing the price is reversing so to define that the price is completely reversed we have to wait for for another break of structure to the downside so this was our break of structure first it's uh, also called like change of character this the second break of structure to the downside confirms that the trend has changed 
to the downside so we can look for a continuation trade like most of the times it's gonna work uh to the downside in this video we're not gonna cover uh in the entries we covered about the entries in other videos as well so please go to our youtube channel and check other videos where we explain the entries so in this channel uh, in this video you have to know that there are something like this um which is called liquidity grab and you should not be fooled with this uh with this occasion and be prepared be prepared and wait always for a second break of structure which confirms the total change of the trend so and personally guys i would really advise it for you to make it like at least on four hourly time frame when you're having a reversal when you're defining your trend on four hourly time frame just please refer to uh uh, please wait for a second break of structure to define that the price price is just going to the downside for example over here guys this is very major example right um we do have this low and we do have this this high the price just plunged down and it's 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 guys uh it's guys um never confirmed it never broke to the downside and over here it started making a minor uh change of the structure to the uh, to the upside so we can um over here we can say that um here here on this period of time we cannot say that there is a complete change of market structure to the downside like uh so because we didn't have a uh, confirmation if we go on the low time frames we do have a lot of like uh false break uh full false breaks um let me find some example over here right uh as you can see uh the price broke structure to the upside and then um it broke structure to the downside overall over here um the price was kind of trending to the upside we did have this break of structure by the week over here the price uh, pulled back it just um it didn't broke the previous low and then it made a new break of structure to the upside so it was completely in an uptrend actually if we see but here over here here we have this manipulation the price just uh, drop below and then started uh, continuing its move uh, like on the original direction maybe somewhere here we do have some examples all right guys actually you can go and look for some examples because uh you know guys i don't like um teach you some cherry picked graphics i only just uh check it on the lifetime with you so uh how this is going um actually not going very bad okay um this was the end guys if you watched it till the end please subscribe hit the like button if you like it if it gives you any value or reminds you something i would be really happy thank you for watching again and have a good training week.